Hey, Quinn here with Mark, and in this quick tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use our free menu maker in just three easy steps. Step one, go ahead and select Start Designing from the Menu Maker page, or you can scroll up to the top and select Sign Up Free in the navigation bar anywhere on the site. If you haven't already, this is going to prompt you to create a new free account with Mark. After completing those steps, you'll land on the logged in homepage of Mark, which brings us to step two. You have a couple options. You can either come up and select new project and then blank project to start from scratch. Or for this example today, we're gonna to go over here and search templates and we're gonna search for menu. Make sure that mark templates is selected here. And now we have a handful of beautiful menus that we can start from and react to. Now we just gotta choose one that we like. And I like this one down here because it showcases some imagery. So I'm gonna double click it and then select create document. We'll give it just a couple seconds to load. And just like that, we now have the beginnings of a beautiful menu without much technical knowledge. Which brings us to step three, the fun part, start designing. You can make changes, add and remove elements such as text, shapes, colors, imagery, and so much more. Let me show you quickly what I mean. Let's make this into a menu for say, a sushi restaurant. So let's come over to stock images and we're gonna search here for sushi. Of course, for your menu, you would use all of your own imagery, but for today, we're gonna grab some free images off the internet. So I'm gonna grab this one here and hover over the existing image until it highlights, and it's going to replace and then resize that image for me. And I'm gonna do that a couple times here. Let's grab that sushi. We're gonna grab this one here. And we'll do it one more time here with another one, say this guy, and we're gonna hover over and let that one replace as well. Okay, and then it looks like some of our text didn't come through because the boxes were too small. So let's just make those bigger and then we center them. So let's go up here and search for a sushi logo. Now in your case, you're gonna to wanna to use your logo and likely you'll want it to be a transparent PNG. But for our example today, let's search for a sushi logo PNG. And then let's go ahead and remove the existing logo and then grab our new logo. And I like this guy here, so I'm gonna double click on it. So we'll insert the image into our menu and I'm gonna put it back up at the top here. Now, obviously there's some black on black stuff here that we'd wanna change out and, and mix up. But for the example, it'll be fine. And then I want the red here throughout the menu. So let's go grab some of our elements and show you how quickly this can be done. I'm gonna grab this fill color and use the document color, which is gonna pull that red immediately. And I'm gonna do it here for this border as well. Alrighty, I went ahead and finished those up. And just like that, in three easy steps, you were able to create a free menu using Mark without much technical design knowledge at all. Go ahead and like and subscribe so that you can stay up on all the latest videos where we show you how to compound these tools to make the most of Mark. For example, collaboration with your team, creating customized brand templates where you can lock in components of these templates, utilizing dynamically populated fields, and ultimately enabling your brand to do so much more. Thanks.